Uh, there's controversies, uh, doctrinal controversies about the Trinity throughout the fourth century. I'm not going to talk about them, but the argument, the reasoning that um, makes it perfectly clear that the Holy Spirit is God the way Jesus is God, the way, or the way the Son, the Word is God, the way God the Father, God the Creator is God, is an argument from the work of the Spirit, which is the work of the Spirit in the world as we experience it. The Spirit who vivifies, who sanctifies, as the creed says, the Lord and giver of life, the spirit who calls the church into being, um, the spirit um, who makes it possible for us to move um, toward uh, the resurrection of the body and life everlasting as the creed concludes. The spirit moves us on. The spirit breathes or blows where it wills, where it will. The spirit stealing from Paul's introduction there um, is the spirit of common sense. It's the spirit that moves us to see what's necessary around us. It moves us to see and empowers us to, to do what needs to be done. It moves us um, really always towards, towards change, but, uh, but always in the co larger context of um, a vision of what is yet to come.